her work, Loretta unites the extreme elements in her life in her very own way. She subtly points out the delicate balance and close link between the familiar and the strange. In addition to this intellectual uprooting, Loretta's work also unleashes various emotional reactions through the use of cliches and archetypes. There is a catch in each of her works. Like most of the time, when I want to make a work, I already have a plan in my head. So I kind of have a picture in my head of how things should look like. Not exactly, of course, yeah? because while you're working, you can change things or you see how it's maybe better with this or that. And, but most of the time, there is some main picture. And then if I have that, then I have to think, okay, this is what I want. And it should look like that. How can I do it? And then I start to think about the material. By juxtaposing contrasting elements, she upsets our normal perception and sets off a whole chain of associations. In this way, she brings the observer into a state of alienation. What first appeared to be so familiar and unambiguous now becomes highly ambivalent. As you can see, you have, these, uh, you have this iron construction of a house, and then in between you have all the, the clothes. And then you have like uh, clothes of, of old people, of young people, all kinds of um, clothing. And it's a piece that is outside, so the weather conditions are actually a part of the work. So when the, when the wind comes in into the work, the clothing of course are like waving and then the stronger the wind, the more, and then suddenly the walls, because the, the clothing are making the walls of the house are suddenly gone, you know, like they, they disappear and it's, it looks like a ruin. And, then, and when it's nice weather and the weather is calm, then all the clothing are just hanging and they form a solid wall of your house. So that's kind of a metaphor for life. allow ourselves to believe that what we see is the only true reality. She shows us a glimpse of a different reality that lies beyond what we see.